Watch me turn this into a lovely pairing for my black bean balls. Hello, hello. Today I'm going to be making a fresh basil pesto. You just need a few simple ingredients. Some olive oil or avocado oil, garlic, some salt, and some fresh basil. To that I also added a really small onion. You'll see that on the left. So there's the basil. I'm going to wash it and prepare to blend the mixture together. After washing, put the basil, the garlic, and the chopped pieces of onion into your food processor, blender, whatever it is that you are using to combine the ingredients. I used a quarter teaspoon of salt for this pesto. Here I'm adding the oil. And I hope my mixture will yield enough to put into this jar. And here I am blending. So I blended and noticed that it would not be enough for the bottle. So I added some more basil to the mixture. I didn't add any more garlic, just basil. And there it is. That is what came out. I'm going to give it a little taste. And it had a bite to it because I put five huge cloves of garlic in there. So it had a really nice bite to it. If you do not like garlic that much, you don't have to put that many garlic cloves, but do as you will with the garlic uh, according to your preference. All right, I am going to put it in the jar. It did not yield as much pesto as I expected. I didn't get a full jar, but it did what I needed it to do, which was to go with my black bean balls. Check out that video.